All right, y'all. So I had this experience happen to me and it made me think about when people ask, like, what are the things that you look for when you're trying to pick a vocal coach? So I had someone call, they were interested in signing up a free consult, which is what I offer at the studio. And they asked about one of my coaches and if they had a vocal and um, what their college degree was and was it in vocals to which I said, no. And they cut me off quick and they said, forget about it. I'm all done. And I was like, this is kind of crappy. It also like, it made me think about like, this person had, they, they didn't even think to ask, right? Like, okay, maybe this person doesn't have a vocal performance degree, but like, what's their experience? Have they studied other programs? Are they trained in a specific vocal program, right? Because there are many people that I know who have vocal degrees, but they're classically trained, which is a lot of the institution. So if you're looking to do contemporary, it's not really gonna be a great fit. And it also does not speak to your vocal ability. Like, are they really good? And then that also leads to another thing too, which is like someone could be really great, but then they don't know how to teach. So. Some things that I would really look for is like, what is this person's experience, right? How long have they been teaching for? Um, you know, and that can be a variant. Maybe they're just starting, but they're like just a really good teacher. But overall, like you should be looking for, do they have a specific program that they operate off of that is yielded of results, right? That's something you can take a look at. And so I feel like for this person, just basing it off of like, do they have a vocal degree is really not going to set them up for success if they're trying to learn from the best, because a lot of people don't necessarily have that. I don't even advise my artists to necessarily go to school for a vocal degree. Do I think it's smart to take voice lessons? A hundred percent. Do I think it's smart to take other courses in the music industry like in the, in the performance music industry field yes but i would probably advise like if you're going to go to school and get a degree and you want to be a musician like look at music business because that's what it is and then take the other thing is continue to hone in your craft but like you don't need a degree to be a performer so hopefully you find this helpful i feel bad for that person because i don't know if they're just basing all of that off of that but this is what i pass on to you so you don't do the same. All right, my friends, hope it helps.